welcome back to my channel if you are new here welcome if you are not welcome back this vlog is gonna be a come to work with me vlog and my birthday vlog i'm only working three days and maybe two days as you can tell i am not in my room i am vlogging from the office that i told you guys that i was working on i officially got my sister and i a desk and I'm organizing things and they're kind of coming out together I'm liking the way they're looking obviously I need to be a little bit more patient because when it's not one thing it's another and I also started school so I'm actually currently right now in class I just finished all my reading and I did a couple of tests so this is my break and I'm going to finish this off get it all done and out the way today I work tonight Friday, I'm doing a mini like birthday at my job where I work at. I don't know if you guys saw the posts on Instagram. And then on Saturday, I'm going out with my friends just to do like a nice dinner and outing. I don't want to go clubbing, at least not this weekend because I have school. So maybe like, maybe next weekend when I don't, like I can't do too much. And if you know me, you know I don't really drink. So I think I'll be drinking, but I also don't want to get so messed up where I don't go to work on Sunday or I don't wake up on Sunday. But we'll see what happens because I don't really ever do anything on my birthday. And I was like, you know what? Like every year is the same. I'm always busy. I need to make time for myself. So I am going to do this. And I cramped all my homework in the first three days. So now I'm just like finishing up assignments and I'm going to go get a couple of things to decorate the tables. I'm not going to go all out. I'll just put like a couple of decorations here and there. I think I'm gonna get like some pizza and cupcakes and call it a day. Nice and simple. So right now I'm just gonna get this out the way. Hopefully my nail tech answers me and she takes me in at three because this nail broke. Maybe you can see it. Also these this was like my set this these last two weeks, but my nail broke. So but I wanted to keep it for my birthday, but I figured I might as well just fix it now. And my birthday theme is pink and red because my favorite color is pink and red. So that's just what I made it. I don't know. I didn't really put much thought into it. So we're just going to see what happens because I did it at the last minute. I have only been promoting it for like two days. So fuck it. We'll see what happens. But let me show you guys my office. So this is currently my desk. Yeah, I know it's a mess. It goes up and down. Um, I still need to get a chair for it. Like, this is my vanity chair, but I'm just moving it around for now. This is my sister's desk. Honestly, I feel like it's a little bit more cute than mine, but whatever. Over here, I'm still working on this. All of the office stuff in here. And I want to get rid of this and put, like, one of those cute rolling carts, a pink rolling cart. But we'll see what happens with that. This is my paddleboard from this weekend i went paddleboarding and camping with my family so i need to put that where it actually goes i kind of just threw it in here and there's poppy oh and then we got our new microwave so here is our old microwave here is the new microwave clearly we still need to put the backsplash oh and then our tile is improving like now poppy's in here this is poppy and this is our old dog she looks kind of scary here but we're not done <laughs> That's my update for now. Things are coming together. I have been super busy. I'm getting through it. But I will take you guys on this weekend. And change of plans.
so once we got back home with all of her stuff i was helping unload the car and move everything into place so i got really busy and honestly forgot to record at work so we're just gonna move into the next day which is the day that i celebrate my birthday at the bar okay what's up guys so today is friday and i have yet to count my money i haven't counted it yet but i think i made like 400 bucks i honestly wasn't even talking to anybody i was not feeling it i was lucky enough to have one of my friends from see me and support me and then that was it that was that was all that i went home and today is friday so now we i just got done dropping off my friend and i decided to paint my hair paint my dye my hair like a brownish color i was tired of the burgundy and also when i went to my hairstylist she literally said oh my god everybody's getting burgundy now and i was like okay well i'm so glad that i'm not anymore now i have to go home and i get ready and then come back but i just went to the bar because i'm having my birthday celebration work celebration at the bar and it's pink and red so it's like valentine's day colors and i got pizza wings shout out to my friend i totally helped me put this together and helped me get the food if you're watching this you know who you are thank you so now yeah like i said i have to go home and get ready and then come back and i will try and vlog a little bit i honestly just want to have fun today because i never do anything for my birthday and i was like you know what not this time not this time so i'll see you guys in the next clip you guys i'm literally on the phone right now with doordash someone stole my pizza or the dasher took it back they have cameras though so we're gonna check eventually because i'm not at work right now and neither is our boss so he's gonna check the cameras to see what happened but this man left it outside instead of knocking on the door to deliver the pizza and the orders were to hand it to me Yes, he texted me, but if the order is to hand it to somebody, just knock on the door. So now I'm at a pizza and I'm over here like fighting for my life, trying to see if they'll get me more delivered or I'm just gonna have to reorder it. Okay, everybody ready? One, two, three. Good morning. So I went on a morning walk already and now we're gonna go get some protein bowls. I still haven't counted my money. And after the protein bowls, I'm gonna go get my nails done, come home and then we'll do a money count. But right now it's officially my birthday. The dog woke me up, Bathme woke me up. He was ready to go to the park. And as you can tell, I'm a little tired. Like I still have kind of mascara, but also I'm tired. So I look like I'm dead. After that, I am probably gonna come home, take a nap and then what the fuck? Oh, this is paint. I use this to cover like paint. This is not dirt. I swear you guys, it's it's paint. Oh, yeah. I gotta tell you something I could do. I could be running or I'm chasing you, but I won't. My camera battery died. We had a good shift. And then on one of our days off, we decided to stay up until 3 a.m. trying to pop a pimple. That's how I got the scab that you guys are about to see. Before you ask me any questions, that's what happened. Y'all, I'm really out here working with this on my face. One of my custies is leaving. So um, he came in and me and one of my girlies got dances. And we basically had like an amazing night. We just left. It's currently, I think, 12.30? So I think I am going to just get like a couple more dances and then get out of here because I am tired and I still have to do my homework. So I want to be able to like wake up earlier so I'm not so tired, mentally drained and get that out of the way. What's up guys? I'm back from my shift and I think we made about almost one game. Not entirely. And I'm whispering because um, my mom is sleeping with me and she's sleeping. So, this is our money count. 
when I traded in some ones. I got some like other monies in here. Okay, so let's get to it. This is one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, seven. Two, three, four, five, eight. One, two, three, four, five, nine, two, four, six, seventy-five. My camera died, so I'm on my iPhone now. I don't know why that fishing pole is there. I don't even fish. A lot goes on in the room when I'm not here, or in the house when I'm not here. Anyways, we have nine hundred eighty-six dollars. Because this was 75 and I forgot what this was, but I counted it together and it was 86. But honestly, the club was dead the last hour. I kept asking people, I was like, dude, just give me a dollar. And they're like, I don't have anything. And I'm like, oh my god. Oh, okay. there he is. <sighs> so I was like, you know what? It's okay. It's okay. Because I was smart. Anyways, it was really late. So I'm going to take all this off, shower, eat, and go to bed. See you guys in the morning. Good morning. Or afternoon, should I say? It is currently 2:21, and I woke up a couple hours ago. I had my breakfast. Well, honestly, I just had like some chicken salad, and now I'm doing my homework. I am currently in a real estate in my prerequisite real estate classes. Um, I decided to go through the community college because. I know that you can buy it online and stuff, but I buy, I bought the course online not too long ago, and then I never did it. And then I was like, I'm going to do it again. And then I didn't do it again. So I think I need that like accountability. So we are currently working on our class. We have to go through the book, and there's like exercises in the book, and then there's some quizzes that I want to take. And I honestly prefer it that way because I it, it helps me like space out the time and the material so it's way better for me to do it that way and then today is a thursday so we have work tonight again at the bar so we are starting there at nine so we're gonna stop doing homework in like three hours so we can take a break and get ready for work my mom made morisqueta, so I'm going to eat some morisqueta. And if you guys don't know what morisqueta is, it's basically white rice with some meat and some sauce. And then you just put it in the in the rice and you mix it together and it's just like, it's fire. If you guys are not on morisqueta, go to some Mexican restaurant and order morisqueta. It's fire. That's all I got planned for today. Tomorrow I have, well, I have a baby shower on Saturday. So tomorrow we're gonna go to the store to see if we can find something that she wanted um, from the registry. Cause we got, is it registry or registrar? I don't know. The list of stuff that the pregnant mom wants. That's what we're gonna look at. And then we're gonna see if we can find something there. Uh, a couple of cute outfits with like some towels and stuff like that, you know, like cute little towels to clean the baby and stuff. I don't know. Also, I was supposed to make a video like for my birthday and my birthday week got just so hectic that I ended up not even recording. So what I did record, I will show you guys in this video. But okay, I'm gonna stop recording and go and finish my homework so I don't have to worry about it on the weekend. Last thing though, I'm gonna show you guys that my desk is out here in the living room now. Uh, because like I said, my mom moved back in with me so the office is no longer an office. And honestly, there's no point of having a desk here because this little right here stays bugging me and you know how he bugs me when i'm on my vanity if you're new here he every single time i'm gonna get ready for work he decides to come in and just push me away from my vanity so since he pushes yeah i'm talking about you look he knows i'm talking about he's like what so i'm over here on the floor with him because he won't let me sit over there he keeps scratching me and pushing me off and now that i sat here he's like over there in the corner not even caring that i'm over here it's a spoiled brat. We're back and we are doing our makeup to go to work. And then, oh, and we are currently watching 
the perfect couple. It's like a murder mystery. So we didn't make it to work <laughs> because my mom was walking my dog and somebody hit my dog. And um, I went over there because they didn't want to give my mom their information. Uh, but it happened to be like in front of their house. So I had to go over there and argue with them for like two hours. And then the cops came and it was a whole thing. Um, the neighbors came out as well and they were actually very helpful. They helped me find the lady's information. And they also said that the lady who was refusing to cooperate, which is the wife of the man who hit my car, I mean hit my dog, uh, are terrible neighbors and that they are always trying to argue with people and that they, <laughs> they said a lot of things uh, about those people and that basically I was like wasting my time trying to talk to them so then they helped me and like invited me over to their uh, to their balcony and helped me get their name and information after me arguing with them for like 20 plus minutes and I also recorded some of it I don't think that I can put it on my YouTube video. Or can you? I don't know. Um, but point is, they were like, Oh, we didn't hit your dog. Or my husband didn't hit your dog. You just want our homeowner's insurance. And da 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 And mind you, my mom, she's not educated around those things. Like, I don't think she even knew that where she was walking was houses. Because they were like townhouses. I'm pretty sure she thought they were apartments like she didn't that's not a thought and also if you hit my dog or if you hit a dog that you know someone's walking the first thing you're gonna do is get their information like yeah and then for all we know like they could have been visiting that area like we didn't know they lived there until they decided to drive all the way into their garage and like open their garage and go into their house sit down i'm like crashing over they uh hit my dog and i was over there arguing with them for a very long time. You know what, I don't think I could put a video, but I think I could put like an audio um, of a lady being crazy. I can't hear anything over you yelling. She was yelling the whole time. Go to that part and show it to this crazy lady. Apparently I'm crazy for trying to find the owner. I'm crazy, but you're telling me to shut up and you almost hit me. Why did I hit you? You can check your camera. You, yeah, I said I almost, yeah, you approached me all yeah, crazy and then you camera. saw that I was recording and you went back into your house. Moving. Just doing this for money, and I'm gonna post this. I'm gonna post this. Please post it. Please post it. Um, yeah. I am smiling about it now because it's over. Well, it's not over. Like, I have to go get my dog checks and stuff. But that happened. So, no, today, Thursday's money count zero dollars. Oh, you know what? No, thirty dollars because one of my custies sent me, uh, 30 bucks for snacks because I was studying today, which I appreciate a thousand because I was ready to kill myself. I was like ready to like end it all. I was not understanding the material, but I got it at the end. The argument went on for like two and a half hours. At that point, I was just like, no, I'm not going to work. <laughs> and I didn't even mean to call out. Like I told my manager and my manager was like, do you need the day off? And I was like, uh, yeah, the police is here and everything. Like they're not trying to cooperate. Oh, and then the cop told me happy birthday. But anyways, hopefully tomorrow's a better day. And you guys have a good rest of your day or good night or whatever you're doing. I'll see you guys in a bit. You guys, I just broke this shit. Like, what the fuck? I'm in the middle of doing my makeup. Today is Friday and we're going to work at the bar. Today I did most of my homework. I just like take notes on a video and then I went to the bank and I paid some bills and then I went to have lunch with one of my girls and honestly it was very much needed. We got some ceviche and then we got some and then we got some birria and then we got some pastries. And then we went home, I went home, and she went home. And now I'm getting ready for work. And then we're gonna go to work. All done with our shift.
Yeah. He's learning how to fetch money. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. You're the boy. You're the boy. Go get the money. I think he smells poppy on me. I'm glad he got normal sized legs. But you got a little teeny tiny leg. <laughs> We're gonna go to the club tonight. But first, priorities. Finishing my assignment. Well, I'm using ChatGPT. But finish the assignment and we're gonna go out. Yeah, and today is Saturday and I work tomorrow. And we just came back from a baby shower. Priorities, priorities. I had some pozole, some carnitas, a lot of carnitas, a lot of chicken. I don't even know how I'm walking right now. <laughs> We'll see you soon. Let me turn her off. <laughs> oh Six hours. But I'm recording for the sake of the vlog. I gotta go. It's Sunday. I spent most of my day recovering. I popped some ibuprofen. And my mom had made some caldo, which came in super clutch. She made caldo like last night. And then I had to eat some of that this morning. And honestly, I didn't even put any meat in it. It was just the vegetables. And in the juice, I couldn't, I couldn't even like handle meat. Um, and then I went to go shower after we dropped off Paula. And then we, I came, no, what did I do? Oh, and then I had the gifts in the car from the baby shower. So I go drop those off. Totally forgot I had them until I got in the car. And then I went to go eat with my mom later and I got some ceviche because I couldn't, I needed something like fresh, like vegetables. So I got that. And I ate a little bit of fries so that, you know, I could like absorb some of the alky. But honestly, last night, your girl yacked it. I yacked it. And apparently I woke everybody up in the house. But whatever, now we're gonna get ready for work. I heard there is a um, football game, it's like uh, Sunday night football. So hopefully that brings people into the club. And uh, yeah, all right, let me get ready and try to drink some of my water so that I can get back to it. This is why I don't drink. Welcome back last night was a sunday fun day um not a lot of people came in from the game because i just realized it was an early game so i think they were done around three and the club doesn't open until nine so that's a lot of time for people to leave i just bought Bobby a new toy oh yeah i wanted to share that with you guys but i forgot i got him these halloween ones and i think the green one is his favorite because it's the one that he keeps playing with. But I got him these squeak and play. And he loves them. But we're doing this in the kitchen. I mean, in the living room because I don't know. I'm just on my desk. But I made myself a protein shake. Delicioso. I also have a sandwich with all the veggies. Actually, I forgot onion, but whatever. Um, and then here is the money from last night. There was a customer that came in out of nowhere, and you know, you know what? It, when they say it only takes one, it only takes one. I think he did like an hour, and then I got a couple other dances here and there. There's this. We're gonna count this up right here. Bit on this piece of paper because 
I don't know why I'm right there. So you got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So it's 49. 49 times 20, 980 plus 10. We 990. Another 10 here. A thousand. And then this is these come in stacks of 20. So that's another 20. And then I'm going to run these through the counter. Mm. And then I have a Zelle of 135 for at 1220. That's a good first Sunday. It's good for Sunday. And honestly, I really needed that because, like I said, Bobby got hit by a dog by a car on Thursday. And I missed my day of work. And everybody said it was popping on Thursday. And I was like, yeah, I bet. Thursdays are always popping. Also, he has his appointment today because, as you guys all know, baby boy only has one eye. Oh, my God. He's, he's being so extra right now. What? Why are you? Why is your mouth like that? Fix your mouth. <laughs> has an appointment for his eye because I feel like his eye is drooling too much. So we're going to go see if he needs like maybe some eye drops and stuff because I just came from the optometrist and they told me that I can only hold my eyes open for no more than five seconds and that get out of the trash. And it's supposed to be 10 seconds. You're supposed to be able to hold your eyes open at least 10 seconds and mine's only like three or four, max five. And they gave me some eye drops and they were asking me questions like, oh, like, are your eyes usually like runny or da 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 da? And I was like, you know what? No, but my dogs are. So I'd rather be safe than sorry because he only has one eye and I have to really, really take care of it. So that's what we're going to go do today at 3.30. I already filed a claim with the fucking insurance because those people that hit my dog didn't want to give the address. So I finally found him. And I took him to the vet. That shit was like $990 or something like that. It was like $900? I don't know. But they need to be held responsible for what they did. Like, why would I just randomly pick some random person to throw my dog in front of the car and, like, do some malicious shit? Like, no. And then, after that, I have a whole bunch of homework to do because my teacher decided to give us a break for our midterm. And then, this week, instead of giving us two chapters like he usually does, he gave us four and then i still have another class that i have to read for so it's like uh hello you might as well just gave us two chapters and the midterm instead of stacking those four chapters after but whatever and then i only have monday tuesday wednesday thursday friday it's due so i have to finish reading at least by thursday so i can do the assignments on friday <sighs> and i also have to go to work so i'm gonna go to work next week i think four days but now seeing how much homework i have i probably just will do three because that would be a lot of stress to try and finish it up if i don't and i don't want to do it on the weekend um because i wanted my brain to relax on the weekend but to recap what did we make saturday was 12 20 and then we did 809 and 970 so not bad like i didn't hit my monthly goal this week but that's okay because I know that I'm not having all the free time in the world. Like, I'm trying to do my school stuff. And I'm also thinking about going traveling once I'm down with my class. Your girl might be going out of state. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I might go, like, down the state. I don't think I want to go out of state. Out of state sounds crazy to me. I don't know. I'm scared. I've heard so many stories of, like, different clubs and stuff. And I'm just, I'm so spoiled at the club that I currently work at. That I'm just like, oh, I don't know if I want to deal with management and other clubs. But I will, because you know what? And to grow, you gotta step out of your comfort zone, and that's what we're gonna do. But today, we're gonna do some basically gym tan laundry. We're going to do, I'm gonna throw my laundry in, I'm gonna run all my errands, and then I'm gonna go to the gym at the end of the night. And I don't need a tan because I'm already brown. If this, I guess this makes the end of my video. Uh, thank you for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. Don't forget to subscribe because if you're watching again, like, if this is your second time watching, just like click the subscribe button. It doesn't. It doesn't cost anything for you to click the subscribe button. He is so extra. He like throw. He throws his balls under my my bed on purpose, so I have to go get them. Cause then he comes and he bugs. Mhm. Mm Ow. Mhm. Mm yeah, yeah. I know. I saw what you did. I saw what you did. Anyways, like, comment, subscribe. 
and I hope you guys have a good day. I hope you guys have a good month and that you guys, um, you guys get a lot of money this month. Bye.